ऐसे और वीडियोस के लिए इस चैनल को सब्सक्राइब करें थ्री टू वन स्टार्ट बीइंग अग्रीव्ड बाय द सेड अवार्ड ऑफ द लेबर कोर्ट द फर्स्ट रिस्पॉन्डेंट हियर इन प्रिफर्ड अ रिट पटिशन बिफोर अ लर्नेड सिंगल जज ऑफ द गुवाहाटी हाई कोर्ट who after hearing the parties came to the conclusion that the finding of the labor court that there was extortion of documents by the workmen concerned was contrary to the charge sheet which did not contain such an allegation it came to the conclusion that allegation of extortion was an afterthought it also accepted the defense of the workmen that they entered the estate only to obtain treatment of the injured workman who was assaulted by the manager of the estate it also held that the labor court did not apply its mind to the vital facts and circumstances of the case as alleged by the learned counsel for the workman who appeared in the said writ petition on that basis the learned single judge came to the conclusion that the labor court did not appreciate the material on record properly and passed the order justifying the dismissal which is disproportionate to the offense alleged it also held that the workmen who were tried before the criminal court were honorably acquitted by the criminal court and the departmental inquiry held by the management was faulty on the said basis it set aside the award and directed the management to reinstate the surviving workmen who have not attained the age of superannuation with compensation of rupees 15000 to each of them in lieu of back wages and to pay compensation of rupees 30000 to each of the workers who have superannuated during the pendency of the proceedings and to fix lump sum compensation in consultation with the petitioner which shall be paid to the actual heir of the workman who expired without getting any benefit it directed the management to pay the said compensation within 6 weeks from the said receipt of its judgment श्री के आर चौधरी लर्नेड सिंगल सीनियर काउंसिल अड्रेसिंग आर्ग्यूमेंट्स ऑन बिहाफ ऑफ द अपेलेंट कंटेंडेड दैट द लेबर कोर्ट हैविंग परमिटेड द पार्टीज टू अड्यूस एविडेंस इन जस्टिफिकेशन और अदरवाइज ऑफ द फाइंडिंग ऑफ द डोमेस्टिक ट्रिब्यूनल एंड हैविंग रिकॉर्डेड एविडेंस इन दिस रिगार्ड जस्टली केम टू द कंक्लूशन दैट द मैनेजमेंट हैज एस्टैब्लिश्ड its case of misconduct against the workman he also contended that the finding in regard to the extortion of the documents was not actually a new charge but was in fact a part of the charge which referred to the wrongful confinement of the manager and there being sufficient material before the labor court both in regard to the long and wrongful confinement of the manager and other officials of the estate as also in regard to the forceful extortion of a document agreeing to pay 20% bonus the labor court was justified in coming to the conclusion that the workmen were also guilty of the said charge of extortion and the original charge as framed by the domestic inquiry having clearly stated about the wrongful confinement of the manager of the estate the labor court in its award on a preliminary point held that the inquiry conducted by the management was not a proper inquiry hence based on the requests made in the statement filed before it permitted the management to adduce evidence in support of its charge in the proceedings before it and also permitted the workmen to adduce evidence in defense in the course of the evidence adduced by the parties a specific allegation that the workmen demanded a promise in writing from the manager of the estate 
to give 20% bonus was in fact made and that on police officer having informed that it will not be possible to control the situation unless such a promise was given by the manager in writing a document to the effect was given by the manager under threat and that only after receipt of the said document workers dispersed at about 3 am on 13th october 1980 was made the labor court having considered the evidence led by the management in this regard as also the counter evidence led by the workmen came to the conclusion that such an extortion of letter under threat was actually obtained